Hello guys, what's up? My name is Ola Kunle. You're welcome to my YouTube channel. If, it's your, if this is your first time, please do well to subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you have subscribed, thank you so much for being part of the development and the growth of this channel. Guys, it has reached us now that the case of Ekwere Madu had come to an end today. And Ekwere Madu, Ike Ekwere Madu and his wife have been found guilty of um, human organ trafficking. This case started about 10 months ago. Um, it was exposed then that they got this young lad in Nigeria, a young boy, who was taken outside the country, precisely the UK, to go and harvest his um, kidney and transplant it to their own daughter, who is having a um, kidney problem. I think that's uh, Sophia. The case became a serious one. A lot of people began to raise issues that uh -uh, it's like someone is using power to oppress the poor because it's like they did it without the consent of that boy, without the consent of that boy, sorry. They did it without the consent of that boy. I don't think even the family of the boy knew about it. Okay, and the innocent boy also followed them to go and do that, but they were caught. Now, the, 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 the case is this, or the, the thing I want to talk about is this. You know, you could remember then if you were aware of the case when it started that the members of the House of Senate, because it's one of them, Ikoramadu is one of them, they were asking the UK government and the UK judiciary to bring the case to Nigeria, that they should release the case to them in Nigeria, that we handle it. My dear, you and I know that if the case had been sent to Nigeria, if UK had agreed right, to release the case to us in Nigeria, the justice or the judgment wouldn't have favored the boy. And no justice anyway in this country. The case would have been swept under, under the carpet. Trust me. So, so this is what we are talking about, that we are looking for a country that works. If UK is not a nation where the system is working, we won't see this justice today. Trust me, you and I know that. We won't, we won't see this justice today. But because UK is a country where the system is working, where humanity is given utmost regard, utmost respect, that is why we could see it today like this. If the case had come to Nigeria, it would have been the end of the boy, the, the innocent boy. Now, people will be like, oh, you are not even pitying them. It's not that I'm not pitying them or Nigerians or Nigerians are not pitying them. The, the thing is, there are consequences for every criminal action or any criminal act. There are consequences. You can't just you can't just be hypocritical about this. There is no hypocritical um, sympathy or anything about this. So, guys, we are we are we are we are trying to make sure that this country works, and that is what we all need to do. Let there be justice. Let justice. Is something that we give regard to in this country. Look at what is happening about the election. During both elections, the presidential and gubernatorial election, a lot of people were killed. Snatching of ballot papers, destruction of electoral um, activities and all that. Until today, no thug had been apprehended. No thug leader had been apprehended. And it is it that we don't know these people? We know, in fact, police. We're helping these people, these thugs. Until now, nothing has been done. So, this case of Ekure Madu is not is not something that we could we should deal with or handle with emotions. Well, sorry for what happened to them, but that's just justice. That's justice. That's justice, and that's how a, a society can work. That's how a country or a nation can work, where humanity is given regard, where no no nobody is um, is 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 respected because they are in position of power when they do something wrong. Guys, well, whatever you think about this, I don't know, you can drop your comments and also give it a like, also share this video. Thank you so much. Please do wait to subscribe to my YouTube channel. I will really appreciate that. God bless you. God bless Nigeria.